North America's longest running rolling food bank fundraiser is once again trekking across Canada and the U.S., Midwest and Northeast in the cross-border mission to feed communities. Since 1999, the CP Holiday Train Program, powered by an army of employee volunteers, has raised 5.6 million and generated close to 2.5 million pounds of food donations for local shelves. That's what this is all about, is supporting your local community. My name is Katie Hill, and I'm proud to be here representing about 14,000 Canadian Pacific employees as I welcome you to our 2011 Canadian Pacific Holiday Train. From Santa Claus handing out candy canes to live performances by Eric Traplin and Sydney Gregg, children and adults of all ages were having a great time enjoying festivities and hot apple cider on this chilly evening in November. For the 13th year, two specially decorated freight trains launched their unique journeys across six Canadian provinces and eight U.S. states. About 150 cities and towns on both sides of the border will join the holiday train spirit and magic with all food and money raised at each stop, staying in the community for local distribution. With the amount of support and efforts by volunteers, Mayor Doug Craig is proud to speak on behalf of Cambridge Council. Welcome to Christmas in Cambridge, and this is the seventh year we've had the train. Most cities in Canada don't get it that often. It's because we have great crowds, we have enthusiastic people, and we have great volunteers for the food bank. Now let's keep on rocking until next year when the train comes on knocking. <laughs>